you're lugging around some uh, some heavy metal right now. Can yeah. we uh, can we bust this thing out? Let's do it. Let's take notice. He's pulling it out of a sock. And he doesn't have a sock sponsor <clears throat> stance. Mm. Josh Christensen, how you doing, bro? Good. How you doing? Good. Good to meet you. Hey, you too. So um, you're here in the big city. You're balling out. You're the man right now. Tell me, uh, <laughs> what's the trip been like? What have you been doing today? He's able to get a haircut. Trying to get a little more fresh looking. A little fit the part of, I guess, this new, this new life I'm, I'm starting to live. We just got me fitted for a suit. I've never worn a suit before, so that was pretty awesome. I'm hoping to look pretty fly. That has a little more texture to it, a little more that like of a weave, like that. that. You like this one? Yeah. Okay. What so far has been the biggest uh, tangible benefit of carrying around a gold medal in your sock? Nick, the other day, was in the back line at Chipotle, and it, there was like 30 people in front of him, he just walks up to the front and goes, hey, I'm sorry, I'm in a rush. I just won this, and, and he, he jumped to the front of the line. We, we got a free dinner the other night. The guys sitting next to us actually saw it just in the corner of their eyes, and like, oh my god, that's, that's an Olympic medal, huh? And I let them look at it, and they bought us a bottle of rosé. <laughs> They kept some champagne rolling all night, so I mean, that's been pretty crazy. Membership has its privileges. Yeah. Arguably, you have one of sort of the best success stories of the whole Olympics. Has you gotten crazy offers? You know, are, are people stepping to you like out of left field now? I, I'd say, like for me in my situation, most of my sponsors were just super excited and stoked for me to, to be going. I didn't have a lot of promotion coming into it, so I think that was what was able to keep me pretty calm at the event and, and relaxed, but we got on a, a cornflakes box, if you saw that. I hadn't seen it. Um, so that was within 24 hours of the podium, so that was pretty huge. Both of your compadres, you know, that got silver and bronze have been beasts on social media. Yeah. You know, one with the dog, one with the date Nick campaign. What are you doing to catch up to those dudes? I was gonna go with the, the Twitter nude pic for a second there. And I thought maybe that's not a good idea. Okay. Because I know that would kind of spark a lot of controversy, but I was thinking of maybe adopting a child. Babies be Well, I, I was about to say, yeah, what, how can I one up puppies? Do you have a different life view, a different career plan now that you're, you know, or is it really down deep sort of just, you know, Joss being Joss? Yeah, I'm still a 12 year old Joss inside who's just looking up to all these guys and, and enjoying it. And it, it's crazy that there's maybe people looking up to me now. Yeah. And it's hard for me to kind of grasp that and uh, I don't know, I think hopefully my life is going to stay somewhat the same, just a lot more opportunities and hopefully a lot more fun and excitement. Enjoy the ride, homie. Thank you. Josh Christensen on Dope.